Hello everybody, it is Wessel Rules 101, and I'm back again with audio problems. This week, we try to open up my Squad Battles rewards from Season 6 or Week 7, whichever you prefer, where I ranked Pro 3. If you're hearing this, that means my audio somehow didn't fuck up this time for Elgato, which is a bonus. But if it isn't, you're obviously not listening to this, so it doesn't fucking matter. You're probably listening to me rant on playback on the uh, highlights. That isn't unless the um, video glitches out, you know. Or maybe I'll do both. Maybe I'll get both today. Ooh. <laughs> Gotta love issues. Anyway, Pro 3. Let's get the rewards sent out. Start with the coins as usual, seven and a half thousand. Yep, throw them in there. All right. So I've had a great streak to touch on the audio, as I'm about to say, and I interrupt myself. But I've had like four or five videos in a row now where my audio has just been fucked completely and utterly. Like before it, my audio was fine. My older videos, like. When I started NHL 19, they were fine. Or 20. Why do I keep saying 19? NHL 20 videos are fine. No huge issues. But like the past three or four times I've been making videos, it's been persistent for some reason. And it's it's the Elgato software. It's not, it's not my editing. It's not my microphone. Because my microphone works on any other program on my computer. So it's, something's happening with the Elgato software. So this video, if you can hear the audio, which I hope, I'm trying a method where I'm using the Elgato sound capture instead of the Elgato live commentary. Don't know why they have live commentary in it if it's a broken fucking feature, but, you know, it beats me. So anyway, let's start. I've got two of the gold uh, players packs. Probably won't get anything good in them, but, you know, you never know. Might Might get something, so I'm throw them in the video quickly boost up the minutes of a I'm already like two minutes into recording and I'm just starting the packs now oh, I'm good at this um, all right so nothing out of those figured as much so then I've got premium players pack three premium packs and then I have the diamond players choice pack from the month of October or I'm sorry no it's the month of November I believe because EA despite saying that they f messed up last time and that they were going to release the packs on time next month didn't do so how apropos of them I don't know if I used that word in the right sentence there yeah whatever since when do I ever care about my language first premium pack our best was uh, Tony D'Angelo, or Anthony D'Angelo before he shortened his name. That seemed to come out of nowhere. Like, when did he when did he start getting known as Tony D'Angelo? That's like I'm assuming he just prefers to be called Tony, so that it, that's just what stuck. Always caught me off guard. I was like, wasn't his name Anthony? <laughs> but I've known people to use Tony as the short form, so. So we get Vinny Hinestroza. I think I pronounced that right. Not bad, not bad. That's our best pull from that one. Alright, so that's two out of the three down the pipe. Hopefully, I can get something good. I don't know if I can pull one of those new heavy hitter uh, master cards. I don't know if you can pull the master cards in the set. In the packs, I mean. If you could, that'd be great. Because I'd like them. But, uh... Won't hold my breath on any of that. Because I'm probably not going to get anything good. It's not easy trying to like put 84, 83, 84s in, in the title. Because those just don't mean crap anymore in this game. Hey, we get a David Kreitzer. Our first uh, above 80 pull of the video. And then we get Eric Johnson. And Goligoski. So, so far, absolute shite. Pure shite. So, will the diamond pack be any different? Probably not. Oh, we get a Ryan Strom prime time. Honestly, really doesn't 
do anything, because they're all pretty much probably worth around the same, so I guess I'll take the Rhinestrom just for the fact that he's in prime time, despite that literally doing nothing. Ooh! Victor Hedman. Um, yeah, I'm taking Anthony Mantha and Victor Hedman here. Anthony Mantha is having a great season so far, actually. Uh, I believe he's at six or seven goals now. Not bad, despite Detroit not being a solid all-around team. But I will take this Victor Hedman. He's part of the new heavy hitters. Uh, and he's got two HH. I, I'm assuming that's a heavy hitter. I'd assume. I, I can't remember the names of all the synergies. And then I've got TN. He's decently fast with some solid body checking. I don't know if he'll fit on my team. He might be worth a good amount, though. So might just go ahead and sell him. So we get another one, Brandon Tanev. Pretty sure he just scored a pretty, he scored a pretty good goal the other night, actually. Uh, I'll take him, because why not? Plus, he's got synergy, so people might be big on that. So that's uh, this is the final round, then. Nope. Nope. Second last round. And it looks like we're having an off round where we get Jeff Skinner. And I'll take Cleft Bomb. Literally doesn't matter. I will not use any of those 80s. Alright, so we get Rasmus Dahlin, and it looks like we're not going to get... Alright, I'll take Buznevich and Dahlin. Most of those guys are just going to be set fodder. Um, yeah, so... Victor Hedman's got to go for something. He's an 86 overall left-handed defenseman. I know there's a lot of high overall left-handed defensemen in the game, but I feel like... I feel like Hedman's going to go for at least... Spitball and based on the market, he's got to be at least 30k, especially with him being new. Because, you know, because he's um he's new, everybody's going to be clamoring for him. Never mind, okay. I keep forgetting about this compare price feature. 98, 91, oh my god, 87 All right, let me uh, put this motherfucker up on the market. I am selling him. Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Yes, please. I will take... Uh, I'll go 86, 1, 2, 3. Yes, I will sell him for 86,000. Oh. Oh, this is so good. So good. That's... That's great. That's better than my last diamond packs for sure. And to celebrate... Fuck it. To celebrate, I'm going to open up one of these almost 19,000. Six gold players, 10 player items, 25 items. I'm going to open one of these. Fuck it. I've got almost 200k. I'll have almost... I'll have like 270 after fucking selling Headman. If he sells, hopefully he does. And plus, I can just use these guys in sets to get myself closer towards getting a good uh, icon card. So, yeah. Get Jack Hughes, that's probably the only, yeah. Well, that was shit. <laughs> ah, whatever. I was in the mood because of that headman. But, ooh, that's, that's a good pull. So that'll, that'll do it for this video now. Uh, hopefully the audio worked, in which case you're hearing this. So that's a thumbs up there. But um, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Um, sorry about the audio issues in previous videos if you've seen them. If not, I guess good, good job you didn't have to deal with that horrible, horrible shit. And like, I, I feel bad for uploading them, but... Like, the, the most recent video was my uh, my hockey bag opening, where I was just having fun kind of parodying uh, massive pack openings people do for Ultimate Team Modes. And the audio glitched, but I had recorded it on Audacity also as a backup. But whenever I'd, like, put it through my editing software, for some reason it just drastically... I don't know why, but... I tried everything I could to get it lined up perfectly, and the video I uploaded was the closest to perfect the file could be, but at times it's it's still off, so 
Yeah, and I, I know it's probably not the best thing to listen to, so I apologize for uh, uploading that stupid stuff. Um, but hopefully, hopefully this method has worked, in which case I can keep using this method to then stop myself from having to torture myself with uh, trying to fix the issues and getting mad because why the fuck is my audio crackling or glitching or is it delayed but uh apart from that it was a successful vi pack opening video hopefully we do good again next week and uh thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed and have a good day